Hey, it's Drew Ben for BenSpark.com, and thanks for tuning in. Uh, today, I am going to unbox Marvel Collector Core Year One, the Year One box. This is an oversized box, a regular box. So, we're going to power box and the Year One box. Let's open her up. Gotta find my slice. There we go. Alright. Doesn't seem tightly packed. It seems to be moving around a little bit. So, your one box. Open her up. Okay. Well, I see what was going around. It's this pin. This Marvel Year One Collector Core pin. It says 2015 because that's where it started. So check that out. And the year one patch says so the same thing. All right. Oh my goodness. All right. What do we got in here? This is talking about year one. This shows all the things that came out for year one, uh, whether you got all of them or not. Uh, but this shows all of year one, and this also shows now what's inside the box here for year one. Okay. All right, and Hikari Japanese vinyl uh, Captain America. So he's all golden. And handmade and crafted inspired by Japanese vinyl. So that is the Captain America in the box. Well, next, Hobgoblin. Okay, so let me open that up. Showing Marvel Collector Core exclusive. So, Hobgoblin on his glider. A couple of dorbs. There is an Ant-Man Dorb. Okay, so this is uh, exclusive to Marvel Collectors Club. I'm not sure what makes that one specifically exclusive. And then uh, She-Hulk, which is also exclusive to Marvel Collector Corp. So, now. So here's our Ant-Man Dorb. And that is our She-Hulk Dorb. Cool. Alright, let's see. Is there anything else left in the box? Alright. An I Am Groot hat. You know, I'm kind of disappointed uh, that there was no shirt um, in, this, in this whole thing. Uh, I... I'm a big fan of the t-shirts, but um, apparently no t-shirt in that one. For the amount of money that box was, a t-shirt should have been in there. Sorry. Um, that, should, that should have been part of that as well. Um, I bought, I buy this. I buy Marvel Collector Core, and this was a special box that I bought special. Um, and, you know, it was their first year one box. I think the biggest thing in there was this uh, Captain America figure. Um, so that is, I don't even know how much that would normally go for. Um, uh, the Hobgoblin, that's okay. It's pretty good. Um, it gives them some facts here. So, She-Hulk. Yeah, um, I don't know. I kind of was expecting a little bit more. I, there definitely could have been a shirt in there. And there was no custom comic in there. It, I don't know. I think you could have added the t-shirt and custom comic. That would have been great. Um, that would have put it over the top. And I think you didn't get quite there, Marvel Collector Core. For the amount of money you pay for it, I, I think it should have been that much better. Um, so that was Marvel uh, Collector Core 
year one, that was that special box that they had. Um, you know, for the most part, pretty good stuff in there. I think uh, if I add it all up, it's probably close to what, what it would cost. Um, just would have expected or, you know, would have liked to have seen uh, a special shirt in there. And uh, I was kind of disappointed in that. Um, so, anyway, this is Drew Bennett from BenSpark.com. You can find me on Instagram at Spencepark, Twitter at Spencepark, at Facebook.com slash I'm not a famous blogger. And you can find me here because I do videos every day for 2016. Thanks for watching.